Low testosterone doesn't just affect how much muscle and strength you can build. It can also have a huge impact on everyday activities and mindset, from chronically low energy and mood swings to poor heart health and tanked libido. If not addressed, low testosterone can become a nightmare. If you suspect you have low T and suffer from some of the common symptoms such as reduced sex drive, reduced erectile function, loss of body hair, muscle loss, low energy, weight gain, or have symptoms of depression, it would be wise to get your levels checked out by a medical professional. That said, before you resort to testosterone injections or dangerous medications, I recommend addressing the low-hanging fruit small changes that can make the biggest difference in your testosterone levels. That's why in this video, I want to share the 10 worst testosterone killers you must avoid so that you can finally get your hormones back in order naturally. So without further ado, let's jump right in. Number 1. Refined Carbs It's no secret that a diet high in sugar isn't conducive with a healthy lifestyle. Mainly because refined carbs lack the nutrient density and fiber content of naturally occurring complex carbs. These simple carbs are made up of short-chain sugar molecules that are quickly broken down, digested, and then either used as energy or stored as body fat. Too much sugar in the diet will result in erratic blood sugar levels, energy fluctuations, and ultimately bottoming out your testosterone levels. In fact, one study published in the Nutrients Journal found that men who consumed high amounts of bread, pastries, and other desserts showed lower testosterone levels, less muscle mass, and carried more body fat. This isn't to say that you should completely eliminate your favorite treats, but rather that they should be consumed in moderation. The majority of your carb intake should be made up of complex sources like sweet potatoes, brown rice, and oatmeal. Also, crank up your consumption of green leafy vegetables and fruit. If the majority of your carbs are coming from complex sources, fruits, and vegetables, then adding a sugary treat here and there won't kill you. Number 2. Lack of Exercise a lack of physical activity is not only bad for your heart, but it can also kill your testosterone levels. Due to rapid improvements in technology, convenience, and availability of food, along with other lifestyle factors, we are becoming less and less active as a society. According to the Centers of Disease Control, only 28% of Americans are meeting the physical activity guidelines set out by the agency. One study published in the American Journal of Epidemiology looked at over 1,200 young men over a four-year period to see how hormone fluctuations were associated with sedentary habits. They found that the individuals who watched approximately five hours of TV showed lower levels of testosterone than more active individuals. Another study published in the Journal of Physiology and Pharmacology looked at the effect of short-term physical activity on testosterone levels in sedentary men. They found that just 15 minutes of exercise every other day for 12 weeks significantly improved testosterone levels. So whether it's lifting weights a few days per week, riding your bike more regularly, or going on walks, being more physically active is imperative to maintaining healthy testosterone levels. Number 3. Poor Sleep According to one study published in the Journal of the American Medical Association, healthy young men who slept less than 5 hours per night for just one week experienced a reduction in testosterone levels equivalent to aging 10 to 15 years. So, not only will lack of sleep disrupt sexual function to a great degree, but it can destroy your ability to build muscle and gain strength. If you're looking for a simple way to improve the quality of your sleep, check out our video, 5 Best Ways to Improve Sleep and Build Muscle Faster. Number 4. High Stress and Anxiety Levels we all experience moments of stress or anxiety in our lives. Some days we have lower stress levels, great workouts, and make some serious gains. While other days are hectic, we feel exhausted, and our workouts suffer. Chronic stress levels, however, can be more problematic. As small bouts of stress and anxiety are manageable and come and go, 
chronic long-term stress can affect our hormone balance, specifically testosterone. T levels will ebb and flow throughout the day, but chronic and intense exposure to stress and or anxiety can have detrimental effects. Research published in the Journal of Anesthesia looked at pain thresholds, pain and anxiety ratings, and testosterone and cortisol levels in 46 healthy men during restful and stressful conditions. They concluded that high levels of stress resulted in lower testosterone. Number 5. Excess Alcohol Consumption Studies have shown that alcohol consumption leads to reduced levels of testosterone as well as increased levels of cortisol. Furthermore, there appears to be a dose-dependent relationship between alcohol consumption and testosterone levels, meaning that the more alcohol you consume, the more your testosterone levels drop. And while I won't suggest that you avoid alcohol altogether, I do recommend you keep it in moderation to minimize the negative effects on your testosterone levels and overall health. Number 6 excess body fat. One study published in the European Journal of Endocrinology followed more than 2,000 men aged 40 and older for around four years. They concluded that fluctuations in body weight were associated with a decrease or increase in testosterone. In other words, those who lost 15% or more of their body weight experienced an increase in testosterone. Conversely, those who gained 15% or more of their body weight decreased their testosterone levels significantly. Now, this isn't to say that you need to be absolutely shredded in order to optimize your hormone levels, but rather that maintaining a healthy body fat will do wonders for your testosterone. Number 7. Hair Loss Medications Hair loss medications are commonly used in the United States to help stop hair loss. And while they can be effective, they do come with downsides. Hair loss in general is caused by an overproduction and sensitivity to testosterone. And while not all men experience hair loss, those that do are usually genetically predisposed. Hair loss medications are designed to block the conversion of testosterone into other active metabolites. One study published in the Journal of steroid biochemistry and molecular biology looked at men utilizing long-term hair loss medications and how hormone levels reacted when taken off. Due to its effects on testosterone and other hormones, the men experienced low libido, impaired sexual function, and depression. It was also observed that hormone levels were still altered after discontinuation. And while I can't tell you to eliminate hair loss medications as an option, I will recommend that you explore or other options before making a decision. Number 8. Trans Fats In 2016, the FDA banned partially hydrogenated oils and deemed them unsafe. However, you can still find trans fats in processed foods like baked goods, fried foods, and pizza. Normally, we associate these fats with heart disease and other ailments, but they can also wreak havoc on our hormones. A cross-sectional study published in the Asian Journal of Andrology looked at the association of fat intake with circulating reproductive hormone levels and testicular volume among men. They found that a diet high in trans fats was associated with lower testosterone levels. Number 9. Vegetable Oils As most vegetable oils contain polyunsaturated fats, which are normally deemed healthy sources, high amounts can be detrimental to testosterone levels. One study published in the Nutrients Journal had men with hypogonadism eating a diet high in polyunsaturated fat and carbs. Hormone levels were measured every hour for five hours. It was found that production of serum testosterone levels decreased during that period. Another study from the Journal of Nutrition and Cancer looked at 69 men aged 43 to 88 and concluded that frequently consuming polyunsaturated fats was associated with significantly lower testosterone levels.
That said, if you're going to cook with oils, I recommend opting for healthier sources such as olive oil, avocado oil, or coconut oil. In fact, one study showed that consuming olive oil led to a 17% increase in testosterone levels in as little as three weeks. So, replacing highly processed cooking oils with healthier fats can not only improve overall health, but also increase your testosterone levels naturally. And number 10, female hormone mimickers. Believe it or not, there are compounds in everyday items that can leach into our bodies and disrupt our hormone balance. Everyday household items like detergents, soaps, shampoos, deodorants, perfumes, hairspray, and even reusable water bottles, just to name a few. One study published in the Environmental Health Perspective hypothesized that the decline in male reproductive health is closely related to the exposure of estrogen-mimicking compounds. And while I'd never recommend ditching soap and deodorant completely, I would suggest that you stick to more natural or organic alternatives. So there you have it, the 10 worst testosterone killers you must avoid. And while I don't expect you to eliminate these completely, limiting exposure or consumption of these items will make a huge positive impact on your testosterone levels. Did you find this video helpful? If so, click the like button below as it'll truly help out the channel. And if you haven't already, make sure you subscribe for more videos and don't forget to turn on post notifications so you don't miss the next one. Peace.